Namaste, Varsha again. Well, so today's topic is about uh, sacred sounds. So a lot of people have been asking me lately about, uh, you know, the sessions I do through sacred sound keys. So, uh, actually, I'm an angel card reader and a uh, sacred sound healer. So what I do is, I download sound keys from the central sun, which is Elsion. And those keys are transmitted through my voice, through my heart, into my clients or any person who has approached me for a private session. I just transmit those codes so that that person heals. Now, what all healing takes place? Now, when we use sacred sound keys, it actually works with the 33 chakra system. Okay, so there are more than 100 chakras in all of us, more than 100. Okay, so like some are inside of our body, some are outside of our body. So we work through the 33 chakra system. Now, second is we balance karma from past lifetimes and the current lifetimes through the sacred sound. Third is uh, we can actually break unhealthy vows, oaths, agreements or contracts that we may have made in any of the past lifetimes or maybe in the current lifetime, you know, which is probably blocking our life in some way, financially, maybe uh, professionally, maybe, uh, you know, in our relationships or uh, in health. So we can just break those contracts, vows or agreements, which, uh, you know, sometimes we make them or create them accidentally, you know. So we can always clear those things so that we can move ahead without, you know, like uh, those obstacles created by those oaths, agreements and contracts. Next is we can connect with our ancestors, and our soul group. So we all have a soul group, right? We belong to a particular soul group. So through the sacred sound healing sessions, we can connect with our soul group. We can converse with, converse with them. We can receive healing, downloads, or whatever messages is uh, necessary for our uh, spiritual growth at this point of time. And when I talk about ancestors, we can connect with like 50 to 100 generations on our father's side, 50 to 100 generations, and even more than that on our mother's side, you know, through sacred sounds. Now, what else we can do? We can actually achieve inner marriage, the sacred sexuality within us, you know, the feminine and the masculine balance, the yin and the yang energies can be balanced inside of us through the sacred sound healing. And then we can also heal any physical ailment. It could be cancer, tumor, blood pressure, you know, maybe renal infection, maybe heart related problems, or, uh, you know, it could be arthritis, it could be diabetes, it could be any issue you know, physically inside of your body, we can heal it through sacred sounds. In case someone is into depression, anxiety, stress, even those things can be healed through sacred sound sessions. Now, there could be some blockages and unhealthy patterns which we all, you know, we carry uh, through our lineage, through our bloodline. So even those blockages, patterns, unhealthy patterns in relationship related to patriarchy or matriarchy, which has been transferred into our blood through the genes or lineage or the bloodline, we can just clear all of that through the sacred sound sessions. And a lot of people have reported and even I have experienced this personally. We do a lot of time travel, you know, uh, you know, it's like if I'm working, say, for example, I'm closing my eyes right now and uh, I see a lifetime which is in probably 16th, 17th, uh, 16th century or maybe 17th century, you know, so we are actually, it's like a teleportation which happens, you know, so our soul travels to that particular time back then or maybe in future lifetimes because I have experienced uh, time travel in past lifetimes and in future lifetimes. Yes, I remember going to Neptune in my spaceship. Uh, ship you know with my parents while I was healing them it was a group session and uh, we also experience astral projection or astral travel yes out of the body experience a lot of my clients have reported and including even I have experienced uh, you know most of the times majority of my uh, majority of my sessions you know I have experienced this that my soul is you know it just leaves my body and then this healing sessions happen you know I'm channeling and I'm chanting and Whatever comes up, for example, a blockage or an ailment or a pattern, all these things just vanish, you know, like that. So that is power of sound. Now, Akashic Records, 
get opened. So as and when required, we work with the Akashic masters, you know, who let us see the lifetimes from where we have to probably heal a blockage or a pattern, you know, or probably an agreement or something, probably uh, a karma, you know, which is not balanced yet. Okay. So, you know, I see the lifetimes as a slideshow. It just happens in front of my eyes. So Akashic records get opened through sacred sound keys. And many people have witnessed themselves actually seeing the records open and they have traveled to those particular lifetimes where we all have healed. I say we because it's a team of ascended masters, my guardian angels, my teachers from the other realms. You know, so it is like we, it is not I, it is a team of angels and guides who speak through me and I'm the one who's like singing or chanting the sound keys, okay? Next is, uh, we also can connect with our guardian angels, spirit guides and crossed over loved ones through the sound healings. You know, a lot of people have witnessed their crossed over parents, their grandparents who appear, you know, in the healing chamber where uh, we are transmitting or we are chanting. So this is an amazing experience because even I have had this experience many times, you know, wherein I uh, speak to my ancestors or my crossed over loved ones like my grandfather, my mother's dad. So even that is possible through sound healing. And next is, it's like uh, we can clear anything, any blockage, any hurdle, any obstacle, you know, which is, uh, I would say, uh, in the field of your finances, your health your profession, your relationship, or maybe blockages on your spiritual path. So sacred sound is one amazing world. You know, I remember reading somewhere that uh, the pyramids, the stones, uh, you know, which create or which make the pyramids and the stones at the Stonehenge, they were not lifted by human by their hands because, and not even machines because those days, those that era, we never had a machines, you know, we never had that kind of technology. So the stones were levitated through the power of sound. Isn't it lovely? So, well, I have been doing secret sound practices, secret, secret sound healing sessions since quite some time now, last few years. So you can trust me with the healing sessions. And I would say you are most welcome. And I welcome you on behalf of my entire team of guides and masters, my ancestors, to experience a profound shift through my sacred sound healing. Thank you so much for listening, you know, paying attention and trying to understand what we really do in a sacred sound session. I'm sure someday, somewhere, you are definitely going to get pulled towards you know, this beautiful experience, which I've been experiencing since last few years. So I welcome you from the core of my heart to experience a profound shift through my sacred sound healing. Thank you so much. All my love to you.